second of the Sabbath. You twist also around the doctrine and you come about eating of swine. Come on, brethren, correct yourself and move away from corruption and lies. God Almighty in the book of Leviticus say, clean and unclean. It's not you that said it. And to you this is clean. And to you that is unclean. The, the swine is unclean. Why make it clean? Why don't you look at Isaiah 66 verse 17 what is there? And they that sanctify themselves in the garden behind one tree eating swine flesh and the abomination and the mouse shall be consuming fire, saith the Lord. Look into what you're doing, brethren. Why you attack me? Yes, you attack me, man. When you attack I the last I I and I father, I and I is called by his name. And while you are talking about and seek to mock locks and all them things, why don't you look at your bald head? And look at your shaven face. And look at what the Bible says. That's why you eat Bob Marley. You know why like Bob Marley said you will never give the power to a bald head. Ah. Yes, sir. And when you read somewhere in Leviticus 19, verse 27, I saw him saying, you know, if you round the corner of your beard and all your head enough, you shave up. Why don't you show the people all these things in the Bible? Why don't you show them that Psalms 133 say Yeran's beard went down to the skirts of his garment? You couldn't mock eye. You don't have a nice strength. You won't have the strength now to tell the people in your church that J E S U S is Jesus, not Jesus. Why don't you try that? But here now, the plain days over now, brethren. Can you jam me out? You can, you can access all of what I've said uh, formerly or earlier on through the YouTube guide. It's still there. Google up priest Vega and I hear what I have to say. I've been saying. I know thing I and hey, 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 I and I did rate you know, but your face stay. And your disrespect. So you see you see the same death where I bring by nice last year. I pronounce it no tonight to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. I and I attack now, brethren. And we pronounce it to the waters, the blood of Jesus Christ of Nathan Spirit of Truth. That if what you say about the Emperor is the truth, my Lord, me pronounce a blessing upon you, Mr. Jennings. If you're married, your wife. Hmm? You get children, your children. If you have assets, everything that you have, if what you say is the truth, I and I say to you, bless, bless, bless. But being in my speaker, I know you tell lie. I say in the name of Iris last year, you're going to go down hard. You're going down. And I doubt you're going to repent. I doubt you'll come out and apologize that you have transgressed against the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Because you cannot prove to me in all the world that the day that you, the, the, the Jesus that you are will on to, prove it now. Give me a date. Give me a month. Give me a ear or tell me where in, 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 in the planet earth, which country Jesus crowned King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Liar. The man that was named Jesus in this Bible here was crowned with a crown of tan. That man never carry a crown. That man never sit down upon a throne. They know you in a church at all about him as King of Kings and Lord of Lords. My, my, my Lord, let me tell you who is Jesus. First of all, the Magen Dave is the star of Bethlehem. A decimal day. 360 degree. Two equated triangles. The first one is First John 5, verse 7. There are three in Zion, the heaven. The Father, the Word, and the Holy Spirit, all three is one. Work it out. There are three that be record in the planet Earth. The water, the blood of Yeshua, Mashiach, and the Spirit of truth. Work it out. That's what I said. Mag and David. You know that Jesus here talking about, you know him is? You, you really don't know what you into, brethren. Because the name no fit. The color no fit. So the power that you have is still a pentagram. 333 degrees, all the false prophecy, all, all of them little highland powder, and, and the tongues where you're talking, and all of what you're doing, it is, before me, it is rubbish. But you are free to speak. And because you are free to speak now, and we have the admonition of how we are to be tolerant, we allow you, but where you're gone too far, death and destruction is at your door. And here I know, brethren, and 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 I want to I I I I take a challenge anywhere anytime. That's why I'm gonna that's why I'm gonna wait till the Sabbath. I talk to you now. Yeah, you're right, fire. If the Jesus that you are so hard to be this God, our Son of God, as you are saying, I challenge you now. I challenge you now, and the world at large will be aware. I have no malice against no country or no president. Come see me have a pray for kings and prelates. But you're right now. It's because he's American. I used to be called all the president version the same, legalize all the Batman thing, which we know God says abomination unto him. Me not gonna leave Jamaica by no invitation. But hear what I said to you now, Mr. Jennings. Why don't you clear up yourself now? Come it what? Me not like to draw you out now to say, prove to me and the country, world at large, where you can bring down fire. You that says apostle. And you abuse Ellis last year, because me draw my sword and I defend the king. Now, I give you seven days. Whichever way you choose to bring fire out of the heavens over your head down and the White House in America. I'm not saying it to pick on the American, but you see, because he's American 
I see because I know that the American have a defense system where Russia, China, Korea, nobody can come to. I give you seven days, Mr. 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 Uh, Mr. Jennings. With your church and all of all the rubbish that you are speaking, bring down fire out of heaven and make it burn the White House. Now, if you cannot do that any seven days you choose, if you cannot get it done in your seven days, I and I is ready to step into this judgment with you from the Blue Mountain where I speak now 3,500 feet above sea level. In the name of Eli Selassie School of Vision, Bible Study, Prophecy and Sabbath Worship, I guarantee you at the cost of my faith, at the cost of my life, if I don't bring no fire out of heaven, come to American defense system and burn a fire in a White House that you shut them out. I don't even fear God's brethren. I never trouble you. The king never trouble you. But man never trouble you. The dreadlocks never trouble you. We allow you in a year lane, you know, come here, come step in a mile lane now and come over to the brethren. Lightning and judgment in your face. Me, I tell you, say, me don't like what you say. Are you not going to repent? Are you not going to apologize? You hear me say, death is at your door. And any way you take it, call for the fire. Me say, seven seals, seven days. It don't have to be instant like Elijah. Come around time, no, me I give the king seven days. While me I pray, and me I chant, and me I call down judgment out of heaven. That the world says you're gone too far, brethren. Too far. We don't trouble you. A long time we're there around. A long time we are tell the world. Says Jesus Christ. is woolly here, red eyes and brown skin. He's a black Christ. Come go and go and search no man. Bob Marley, the same man you fight against. What Bob say, oh, I will never forget how they crucified Jesus Christ. But you know about you? When Bob Marley said, hmm, he feel like bomb up a church like what you into. You know why? You see, when he found out that the pastor was just lying, you know, I lie what he was telling and telling now. But Jesus is the son of God. I lie, you are tell Jesus a jacket. The name done under the Bible. J E S U S can't be Jesus. And Wooly here, Red Eyes and Branson can't be the white man God. So who, who are you talking to? Brethren, me vex. Yeah, you make me vex. A long time you watch you. But me know a long time you, 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 you call it a river rat. You, 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 you're skillful figure you around. You draw some things and you bury some things. You dodge from the pork. You dodge from the seventh day, which is the Sabbath day. Come on, don't tell me you don't know astrology. But in case you forget. The days of the week are what? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday is the seventh day. You don't need me to tell you that. Eh? That's why I'm saying, you know, Jeremiah 10 verse 21, For the pastors, including you, have become brutish and have not sought the Lord. Therefore, you're not going to prosper. All of what you are going to perish. He said, I'll send Jeremiah 23. He said, Woe be unto the pastor that have led my sheep astray and have scattered the flock. When you fight against last year, you bring down death and destruction upon yourself and your household. Can you tell any lies? Have you been at the king's funeral? Did you see his body lay in state? Liar, man. I was in America and I read the Britannica Encyclopedia. You know what I saw? That the death that they clear of Haile Selassie the first was without legal or medical confirmation, which caused some political observer to suspect the possibility of murder. You come take suspicion. You, you, you know, God, you don't even know his Melchizedek. You don't even know that Melchizedek was an apparition. You don't study your scripture and say, He that is without beginning of days or end of life must be God. Oh, I'm telling you, he that man, I'm telling you. You don't even know that Melchizedek came back again in the Immaculate Conception to know that there is no boundary, boundary to omnipotence. The man go to a virgin womb, it was impossible to show that he was God Almighty. And him give him three crown of time in the macro. Well, I'm to you, virgin, why you know? You know anything? You can't talk to Rasta. You are 2,000 years behind. The lion is here now. The lion and the lamb is one by characteristic. Go and study your Bible and shut your face him out. Yeah, shut your face them out and humble yourself because Saul was humble with thunder, lightning and fire and I am here to humble you now. Call out this test what I call for. Beg your American government say, draw out the Rasta man in the blue mountain and see if you don't mean everything what I say. And you choose your White House because most be there you're speaking from and bring the fire of God out of heaven up and that in seven days I will give you and if you fail I will step in the judgment. Man, what man? And, and you know something, you're going to perish for your fierceness. You're not going to repent. You will perish for your fierceness. And, and people of the world, forgive me for my wrath tonight. Because normally I'm not like so. 
And I could wait on the Sabbath day to answer this man who's being very so bombastic and insidious and repugnant and atrocious and malicious. I serve the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. And the man that was crucified get tired that man couldn't be king of kings. We stole him sit pan and now the man come back in him glory. And you not go fling death. Have you not read? Or have you not read Psalm 72, verse 15? Man, you think you know nothing? He said, and I shall live. Jesus was crucified. And if you come back for proof, say me, him come back to life again. This man say, and he shall live. And to him shall the gold be given unto. Prayer shall be offered for him continually. And daily shall he be praised. Man, you, man, you don't even know it's God Almighty. You think Jesus is God? A bapa met a bear, 233 degrees in Illuminati and the large house. That is the power you have. Go and examine yourself, Jennings. Who is you? Go and examine yourself. You have not been properly taught. You are not humble either, man. So, yes, me stand in the challenge. That's why I'm talking to you now. I can't wait till Sabbath. I couldn't sleep tonight until me answer you. Like a fierce man. Like a bald head. Who is you? You know, here when all David sent out this spy and, and them cut off all the man, them pants about him since you know what I'm saying. Let them stay in the city of refuge until their beards are properly grown. You can't come insult me. 